and welcome back to another video. Welcome to the channel if you're new. This channel is all about enjoying food, trying food, baking food, cooking food, and enjoying food. Today, I bring you back another cheat day, but I am not starting off the day by myself. I actually gonna be joined by my friend Ashley, who is also a fellow donut queen, and we wanted to do that for so long, but we didn't have a chance, but finally the day is here, and we ordered some customized donuts at Jupiter Donuts, and I'm so excited to do that with her and review some donuts, I guess. So yeah, let's pick up Ashley. Hi to Ashley. Hi. This is Ashley. <laughs> and these are the freaking donuts. How many donuts did you get in total? Oh, am I, I don't know. Maybe 15? 15 donuts. Maybe 16? Are we going to sample all of them? Yes. Are you excited? Yes! <laughs> okay, let's do this. All right, so Ashley surprised me with uh, slightly more donuts than anticipated. So big shout out to Ashley. Thank you so much for getting all these donuts and it. put in the order. So what I initially ordered were five cronuts and, and one, one donut for Nate. Yeah, so I have a maple bacon. This is a raspberry cheesecake, I think. This is a French toast. This is a peanut butter Nutella and this is a Nutella one, which I'm super excited about. Ashley also got a maple bacon bar and of course an apple fritter. I mean, how can you not? Krona balls and a French toast donut. Huh? And then what did you get for yourself? So these are kind of like some that I have had, but like wanted to kind of change it up. So we've got apple pie. Oh, that, that is a good idea. I should have thought of that. We have raspberry filled because I know you like your raspberry filled. Have you ever had their butter crunch? No, I have not. It's like a, a buttery coconut toffee blend. It's fabulous. Okay. This is just a cinnamon sugar old fashioned. Okay. I'm not a cake donut girl and I know Maybe, you're more of a yeast donut yeah, girl yeah, too, yeah. but their old fashions are it's, fire. Okay. Strawberry sprinkle. Of course. For you and me. <laughs> and then this was one, a special they had today. This was a raspberry toasted coconut. Okay. So I said, I why not? I hear you. Want to start with, our cr with the cronuts? Yeah, yeah, let's, let's, okay, let's, let's do, do it. cronuts. Yeah, we're equipped. We have plates and knives and everything that you need. Because and when you ride with a mom, <laughs> we got everything you need. That is, I mean, it cannot be better. All right, so do you want to, why don't you pick the one you want, you can hold it up and then I'll cut it in half. All right, we'll do Where do the, we want to start? We'll do the Nutella one. Nutella and then glazed. Here's a knife for my girl. <laughs> this is so good. We thought that if we got a bunch and just split them, then yeah, we, we can have more different flavors. Yeah, so go. Thank you, my friend. And oh. cheers to some cronuts. Cheers. Oh, Nutella. Uh-huh. Man, this is going to be gone in two bites. <laughs> yeah. Ooh. Mm -hmm. I mean, come on now. These cronuts are so flaky, flaky and crunchy, but not too heavy. Mm -mm. Oh Amazing God. cronuts. Mm -hmm. And you're the one that introduced me to cronuts. I was like, what's a cronut? And you were like, you never had a cronut? It's a croissant that's just glazed. Mm -hmm. It's still good, but like. But this is, come on. <laughs> this is, this is where it's at, my Ooh, friends. Ooh, girl. I would say 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. <laughs> Easily. You choose the next one. I mean, I love maple bacon, so. There we go. Let's see. The maple bacon, this is the cronut. They do have maple bacon as a donut, right? As donuts? As got, a bar. I got that one too. Maybe we'll try that next for comparative analysis. Uh, that That is very, like, I can't argue with the signs. Mm -hmm. I like how thick the bacon is, that they leave it in strips yeah, and not... Do you notice at Mojo, it's still really good, but at Mojo Donuts, it's the crumbly yeah, bacon. Yeah, I don't like that. It's very... But here, um, we've got nice, thick strips. And their maple frosting is so good. Cheers to that. Cheers, my friend. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm. Wow. Wow. I'm telling you. Wow. <laughs> Their cronuts are insane, huh? Everything is like works with them. Their cronuts are just not normal. This is like... How much cronut do I have in my hair? I don't know. Uh, I'm not sure. Half, maybe? Yeah. That's <laughs> wow. That's awesome. Right? Because yeah, I've really... only ever had maple bacon on their maple bacon bar. Which is not bad, but it's just like... Their cronuts are... Oh. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Also, their bacon is just the best. 
like you said, the so crumbly. Crispy. I don't really like because it gets chewy, and then there's a lot of like chewy fatty Grease. parts in there. Yeah. yeah. No, the, I like the crispy as well. Mm -hmm. Wow. <laughs> wow. All right, maple bacon bar. Yeah. Oh, oh my God, this is ginormous as well. Maybe we should do like quarters. Yeah. Okay. Because we gotta get through everything, All right? right yeah, we'll We're do doing quarters because yeah, we have we got 15 donuts to go through. Now I will say their cronuts are obviously incredible. Yeah. But their dough, in my opinion, is like the fluffiest yeast dough like I've ever had. Yeah. Mm -hmm. you, you 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 like this one? I'm a big fan of just like their yeast I dough. I didn't have their donuts in a long time, so cheers to that. <laughs> cheers, my friend. Yeah. I mean, on the Krona, it's more like decadent. Mm -hmm. but I love this dough. It's really good. Uh huh. <laughs> I mean, I wouldn't say no to either. So. I think I prefer the Krona, but just because it's a little more like special. Mm -hmm. Like donuts are more available, I guess. <laughs> well, the Krona, like finding a good Krona. I agree. However, I'm such a yeast dough fan. Me too. And their yeast dough is so fluffy. I don't think yeah, I can pick between the two. I would just have both. Like we just did. Yeah, we just you know both smash. Mm -hmm. you know? <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But that one's that one's really good Delish. too. Mm -hmm. Okay, doing good. <laughs> I'm gonna let you pick the next one. You French toast one. I do. And then we'll have to do for comparative analysis the yeast French toast donut of because it only do. makes sense. I love their like the French toast one. I love both. Like I love the donut and I love the cronut. Awesome. This is like an all star donut. This is one of the best, the best yeah. flavor donuts I've ever had. Yeah, I agree. It's like a thick cinnamon um, layer. Oh my god! It really layer. just tastes exactly like French toast. And then yeah, cream cheese frosting. Mm -hmm. So <laughs> this is ridiculous. <laughs> it's like the amount of cinnamon, like goo on it. So much cinnamon, like cinnamon toast crunch, but like a million times better. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm wow. Oh, it's just so good. That's so good. Why is that so good? I don't know. Especially on this one. I I, I love donuts, but these cronuts are cronuts just... are next level. Yeah. Police is coming for us. Mhm. Mm yeah, we're in big trouble. Mhm. Mm big trouble. Too many donuts per person. Mhm. Mm Exceeding the legal limit. No I'm telling thing. you. Yep. Wow. <laughs> this is so good. Wow. I'm gonna immediately reach for the French toast donut. French toast yeast donut. Want, Correct. Should we go quarters on that one? Uh, yeah, we can do that because we both had it, right? <laughs> Cheers to the uh, Cheers French to toast donut. Yeast donut. Yeah, I mean. That dough. I mean, come on now. That is, their um, cronuts are insane, but their yeast dough is insane too. Yeah, it's good. And like this, this, like the French toast is just. This top five best donut I've ever had in my life. Mm -hmm. This flavor so is just simple, but perfect. They nailed that one. I'm not speechless. <laughs> so we have the raspberry cheesecake and cronut, Nutella, peanut, Nutella butter. peanut butter cronut. You want to go for that one? We'll do half on that one. I'm, I'm oh, assuming, yeah. right? Oh yeah. No, the cronuts, the cronuts, we go all out because they're special. Yeah. These are they're special. custom made. Yeah. These the cronuts are all custom. Wow. So you see the Nutella is just layered in there, and then there's a grid of peanut butter I just destroyed. Yeah, you got it. <laughs> wow. Yeah, this is, um, I mean, it's a classic combination, so you can't go wrong with that on a Krona. <laughs> Cheers. Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. This that was, is where it's at. That, that's <laughs> that's 12, a winner. 12 out of 10. This is so thick, I love it. Mm-hmm. She, oh. She's thick. Mm -hmm. she, she real. Mighty she, thick. She thick as hell. Oh girl. It's like oozing out. <laughs> oh my god. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. Wow. Okay, I love this one. Wow. Mm. Wow. <laughs> See, I think these creations that you asked for should be on the regular menu. They could do so many great things with their cronuts in general. They should make like special cronuts, right? Because they usually just do a basic cronut. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Which is good, but they so could good. blow it out of the water. Like I had many donuts, uh, cronuts, donuts too, but cronuts, but these ones. Because I've had really greasy cronuts. And I had really dry cronuts, you know, like dry as These hell. are just perfect. Should All right. we kill the last one? Is that the last one? This is the last cronut and it is a- So pretty too. This is a- uh, Raspberry- um, Olivia original. <laughs> raspberry cheesecake. <laughs> so, so be it. Okay. Ooh, okay. Oh, yeah. So here goes nothing. Raspberry cheesecake. Ooh. Cheers. 
mm -hmm. <laughs> something fruity, you know, <laughs> kind of fresh, something lighter, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. so to speak. Yeah. Oh, yeah, a little fruity to change it up. Yeah, this is yeah delectable. Perfect word, perfect word. I was just wondering that second. Mm -hmm. Does it even make sense that word? <laughs> Wow. Mm -hmm. I just like the raspberry jam. Like raspberries, for me personally, superior. I, uh, I completely agree. Um, I had completely written off jelly filled donuts <laughs> until I started watching your YouTube channel <laughs> and saw you eating raspberry filled donuts and I was like, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna give them a shot. And um, they're fire. I do not like that fake strawberry taste. That's that's my issue. Mm -hmm. Like it's fine on the, you know, strawberry sprinkle, mm -hmm. but not the, not the jelly. Mm -mm. Alrighty. Oh, you know what I do think we should just grab real quick? Let me just finish the cronut. Oh yeah, yeah, we have I a got little... each of us a cronut bite. Oh, look. They're like upgraded munchkin <sighs> that you grow donuts does. I was about to say, upgraded, like uh -huh. superior if the, if level. If these were dipped in Nutella, see you uh, later. Uh-huh. Mm. Those are adorable. You're, You're so just, cute. you know, light, light knit a little snack. Yeah, a little snacky. Mmm. <laughs> gone in second. Yep, two seconds gone. Crumbs. So here's the thing. So I ordered every flavor of Grand Snacks. I and appreciate it. <laughs> I haven't gotten to try any of them. But Livy and I have like very similar taste buds and we both love granola. And I figured if we're doing a donut morning, shouldn't I try the donut flavor? So I got it. So. I, I think that's awesome. Big shout out to everyone who ordered. I so appreciate it. It's really cool. Like, it's awesome. Oh, <gasps> the smell. This one is the strawberry spring. Yeah, the smell, the... though. <laughs> oh, my. Oh, wow. Okay. Let me, let me, let, I didn't have, let me see. Come on now. You know, I'm very critical when it comes to my own product. Okay, okay, let's see, let's see. So, All right, so I'm gonna do the same. I'm gonna grab a little bite of this. So we've got this like pink looking, almost like bar. Yeah, it's um with candy pop rocks. I hope they're still like, you ordered them a while back, right? Mm hmm I hope they're still popping. <laughs> pop, pop, pop. And then like the actual granola. So I'm gonna start with this. I love granola. Mmm. It's like strawberry, it's like a strawberry pop tart. Wait, I'm gonna try this one too. Mm. <laughs> it's actually good. <laughs> I'm very critical when it comes back. And this is the what is this? So this is supposed to be a strawberry brittle with like candy strawberry pop rocks, but sometimes in the bag they come off and mm. they don't pop no more. <laughs> That's together. delicious, Liv. You like it? Sandwich. <laughs> it's mm. like the classical strawberry. It's strawberry donut. That's what it is. <laughs> mm. You like it? I'm in love. Oh, thank you so much. I want to top it with milk. Yeah, but with milk, it's like or with milk. Ice, ice cream, yogurt. <laughs> <laughs> Everything that needs a crunch. That's fire. I appreciate it. Love you. <laughs> I'm so happy you like it. I love it. Somebody has to park right next to us, right? I mean, come on now, sir. <laughs> It's fine. You can judge us. We're actually in the middle of two cars right now. Yeah, but in the left, nobody's in there. As far as like, no, there is somebody in there. We're in the middle of two cars now, and we're eating donuts. Okay, let's <gasps> talking off. Let's proceed. Okay, let's proceed. These Some are the ones that I so that Ashley ordered. Yep, and they look so good. Hey, babes. All right, let's do this. I'm gonna let you pick where we start. Okay, apple, apple pie. <laughs> apple pie. Sorry, this had to be. We're doing half on the, this one too, right? You want to do half of the half? Or I want to do a whole half. Yeah, that's what I mean. Half yeah. half of the entire donut. Yeah. <laughs> she was disappointed in me there for a second. What, like, what do you mean half? All right, this dough. Looks, come on now. Yeah, it looks She's amazing. Bonkers. Cheers. Cheers. Oh yeah. With that the caramel on top. Caramel drizzle. And crumbles. The crumbles. Is that maybe a graham cracker crumble? Did you? Is that a custom order? No. No. This they, is one. Of, this is one of their staples. They don't have it every really? day. I don't think. But oh. this is one I've had here before. So good, right? This is amazing. Wow. This is really good. I'm glad you like it. I love apple pie. Mm -hmm, I'm a too. fan. I'm a big fan. I don't know. I didn't think of that. This on a Corona would be really good too. The dough. Why is it so <laughs> fluffy? What is the secret? I need to know. Because I've had some yeast doughs that were not fluffy at all. Dough conditioner. Mm -hmm. I can tell you that. That's what it is. I love that one. Uh huh. That's a great donut. I don't know what they did to the crumb, but it's amazing. 
And it's nice to have like a little crunch. It is. Just it to is. like change yeah. it up. To like, and not too like heavy of food, like not entire nuts or something on mm -hmm. there, but like little tiny mm -hmm. crumb pieces. How much donut is in my hair? Tell the truth. Honestly, your hair is, hair is beautiful, by the way. Thank you. Um, not surprisingly. Woo! <laughs> Next, why don't we do, you know what? Speaking of Nate, let's do the strawberry sprinkle. Okay. It's for you, Nate. I know how you love the strawberry <laughs> sprinkle. And one thing I really like about the strawberry frosting at Jupiter is like, it doesn't taste like fake strawberry. I think it tastes like oh, it tastes more like, like fresh strawberries. I think I'll do a quarter of that one. Yeah, I'm gonna do a quarter too because I don't, I want to really enjoy the rest. So. Yeah, we, we still have an right. apple fritter and that, four more donuts. That fritter. So yeah, you're right. You're right. Cheers, Cheers. for Nate. Oh, that looks good. I really like the strawberry mm -hmm. frosting. It doesn't taste like too much like strawberry, it's just nice. Who has your favorite strawberry frosting? So Mojo Donna has a, it's called cotton candy. And the cotton candy is, it's not strawberry. It's like, it looks like a strawberry mm -hmm. um, sprinkled donut, but I, I don't know what it is. They call it cotton candy and I think it's great. That's your fave, okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> How do you not have a drink? Hmm. You know what? I was wondering the same thing just right now. <laughs> All right. Let's do this one. Okay, so this is butter crunch. I love okay. this one. I think this is such, we'll do quarters again. Yeah. Because it's coconut, but um, it's not big chunks of coconut. I actually really like big chunks of coconut too, but they like grind the coconut up. And I think that for, I don't know what they do to it, but it reminds me of um, Thank like you. toffee. Okay, yeah, I can smell the coconut. But um, I like coconut is growing on me. Something's coconutty. I, I remember you used to be like, I don't like coconut, and then I I've yeah, seen you yeah. trying coconut, and it's I see and it's growing on Some things, like you. especially toasted one, is is amazing. That's so. the way to go. Cheers, my sister. Oh yeah, I like this one. Mm -hmm. Honestly, it barely tastes like coconut at all. Like it's light, but it's it's nice. Yeah, it's like very subtle toasted coconut flavor. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I love that one. Very delicious. Looks you, boring, but so should we do the raspberry one? The we're yeah we're talking. Their raspberry filling is just so so good. So, so this I is mean, just the glazed plain glazed raspberry. raspberry. But hey, cheers. You know, cheers. This is a really good one. Mhm. Mm it's just simple. And but perfect. It's just like your classic jelly filled donut, but upgraded, you know? It's like, a really good jelly. It's a good jelly, it's good dough, mm. it's glazed. Mmm, oh, so good. So, we've got. Have you ever had their old fashioned? I have never had an old fashioned donut. What? Yeah, so. We're both yeast donut girls. Yeah. I just feel like a cake donut is, is cake. If I'm going out for donuts, I'm exactly. donut. Exactly. <laughs> this is the best explanation, yeah. It's old fashioned donuts are a cake donut, but they are they have sour cream in the in the, in the batter. batter. Yeah. So um, I guess that, that the texture's a little different. Okay. Maybe a little more dense than a regular cake donut. Okay. Considering you're a yeast donut girl like me, you might find this kind of dry. I happen to love. No, their I'm old like, fashion. I am open to anything. Okay. Honestly, it's just like a good cake. Mm -hmm. It's like a good mm -hmm. cinnamon sugar cake, and I don't hate it at all. There you go. There mm. you go. No, like I this? had an unglazed old fashioned at Dunkin' Donuts once. Oh, well, their mm -hmm. old fashioned is not very good. Exactly, and ever since I was a little bit, you know, apprehensive. <laughs> but this one. And they also make this one glazed. Mm. Mm -hmm. This one, I was, just, the I was just intrigued. Yeah, it's, it's very pretty. What, what is even so on this these? is a raspberry frosted donut with toasted coconut this is one I've never tried a, they're a raspberry frosting so raspberry frosting it looks like a yogurt frosting and some yeah I don't know coconut yeah awesome cheers cheers mm-hmm mm -hmm. That's nice. Yeah. That's nice. It's it's the raspberry, it's not very dominant. It, no. Right? It's kind of mild actually. It's very mild. And then the coconut actually in this one is a little more protruding, I think. Mm-hmm. But I like it. It's fresh. I agree. Mm-hmm. 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 Ooh. We have one last important thing, right? We sure do. And do you want to know what I really think you need to do? Just because I happen to think their apple fritter is spectacular. Oh, I love I think um, that these are my favorite apple fritters. And I like, mean, look at the size of Olivia's head, and then look at the size of this fritter. <laughs> it's like the same size. That's not normal. But That's, it's so do you want to do a break? Oh, yeah. A break for your crew? Let's, let's do it. Let's do it. I think it's the right thing to do. We'll All do right, a guys. break. I mean. Oh, come on. 
it oh. is so like look at the layers mm -hmm. this dough like this apple fritter dough is really one of my favorite like it's my favorite it's it's the favorite apple fritter i've ever had yeah but cheers <laughs> Mm -hmm. I mean, I hear the crunch when, when we bite into this. It's because they get the outside nice and crispy, crunchy. Yeah. But the inside's so soft. And also, it's not filled with grease, like usually. I've had a greasy apple fritter. Mm. I don't like that. Not when the oil seeps into it, right? Oof. But this one is just the light, if you will. I just am so in love <laughs> with this donut. Yeah. When we had the Jupiter Donuts close, staple. Staple. Mm -hmm. This this is a ten out of ten. Also. Yeah, this is the best. Like if you have a chance to go to Jupiter Donuts, get an apple fritter. Get the fritter. You gotta get the fritter. Have them. Oh look, a nice chunk of apple. Yeah. It's hey like... babe. <laughs> <laughs> He's like turning around. Oh no, sir! Not you! <laughs> Not you, babe! This babe! Wrong babe! Mm -mm. <laughs> <laughs> I love that crunch. Mm -hmm. Such a nice contrast to the this inside. Is... Insane. Mm -hmm. I... Also, I feel more comfortable being in the car with someone, even like people around. Oh. I feel so weirded out all the time because I sit alone in my and car. You know? talking, right. Uh huh. But if there's someone, this could be like GPS setup or something. Right, right, right. No, <laughs> it, it was freaky. a Donut Queen exclusive. Yeah, you know. And it was so much fun. We should do that more often. 1,000%. And try new places too. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Really successful. So fun. So much fun. So happy we got to do this. Yeah, finally. And guys, let me know in the comments down below if you should do that more often because I thought it was fucking fun. Amazing. It's so much more fun than sitting by myself, you know? Yeah. I don't know. I think we'll try to clean up. And I see you later. Ashley, thank you so much for the donuts. Thank you. I so you. appreciate it. And um, I'll see you. Alrighty guys, it has been a little while and we're back for some snacks. Some incredible monster muffin. Oh my god, guys, if you haven't already, check monster muffins out. It's my friend Krista. She makes the most amazing muffins. And of course, some chips and some hot chocolate. And I'm gonna watch Bling Empire, but... Before I get into those snacks, I want to give a huge shout out to a company that has been saving my cooking life and made my life so much easier and is today's sponsor of this video, HelloFresh. HelloFresh has become my absolute obsession as it combines the freshness and tastiness of your own cooking with convenience. HelloFresh is a meal subscription that is not only super convenient but also super flexible. Not only can I customize my orders each week and choose from one of many meal options such as meat, vegetarian or calorie smart, but I can also just skip an entire week if I have other plans. Most importantly for me though is that it saves me so much time. As you guys know I love cooking but I've been so busy recently that I just reverted to my three standard recipes so that I don't have to think about what to cook and what to buy. With HelloFresh I don't have to scroll through endless recipes and walk around the supermarket forever to find the ingredients. Everything is pre-weighed and comes with super easy instructions so I can cook and prepare everything in under 30 minutes. And I save more than an hour worth of grocery shopping which I honestly just don't have the nerve to when I was working the entire day. While my current favorite meal plans are the meat and veggie and the calorie smart one, every Every meal plan option comes with tons of fresh produce and high quality ingredients which contributes to a balanced diet. The recipe I made here are the cherry balsamic pork chops which were super easy to make yet full of flavor and as fresh as they could be. I honestly don't know why I haven't tried HelloFresh way earlier. If you guys want to try out HelloFresh go to hellofresh.com and use code alwayshungry10 to get 10 free meals including free shipping. Thank you HelloFresh for sponsoring this video and I appreciate you guys. Alrighty guys, and now I'd say I'm gonna get into some Bling Empire, some muffins, some chips, and you'll join me. And uh, yeah, Bling Empire, very interesting show. Really like it. Could recommend if you like TLC, great stuff. <laughs>
Guys, that was delicious. The muffin was so good. Um, I'm gonna have my hot chocolate. Probably take a nap and I'll catch you a little later. Alrighty, so we're on our way to Starbucks and I wanted to try a new drink. Not a new drink on the menu, but a new custom drink that I found online. It's a Twix drink. So apparently what you do is you get a caramel frappuccino, you add mocha, and you add hazelnut syrup, and then mocha drizzle. And I think I'll try that. What do you think of that? I'm gonna try yours, but I'm not gonna have it. He's not gonna have it. I'll but just try yours. Also what I'm gonna have, I'm, I think I'm gonna have these egg bites again, the sous vide or sous vide, um, because I need something salty. <laughs> what coffee are you getting? Honestly, probably just a basic bitch iced coffee. Oh my god, you're so cute! Oh, what is this? Oh, what is this? Oh, it's a booty. Where did you get the reason? It's just a How you doing? Here's that. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, yay. One drink. Thank you. Have a great morning. You, you too, you. thank you. Here is my Twix drink. So it's a caramel frappuccino and I can read to you exactly what it is. Okay. You also add hazelnut syrup, Yava chips, and extra caramel plus a mocha drizzle. That's what I did and that's the Twix apparently. Mine tastes like the Twix. Mm. Just kidding. It's not bad, but I think they gave me the coffee version, which I didn't want. This should not be um, with coffee, but I think it is. I think you're, is yours with coffee? I hope so. It's supposed to be with coffee, right? Mm-hmm. This is definitely with coffee. Yours is not. Really? Nope. Oh, well. I got a brain freeze. Anyways, I got my egg bites again, the sous vide. Here they are, and they look fantastic. Your family, which is that being so no. Yeah, you're making it worse. Did you want a bite? Me? Mm-hmm. Mm. No. No? No, I don't. Yeah, that's right. Get a Oreo. You do want a bite, huh? No, I don't actually, because I have my teeth in. And it's a nuisance. Egg. No, I'm... These are great. The bacon grillé. Mm, that's good. Mm -hmm. mm. It warms my life. It does warm life up. Mm. Yeah, that's right, Oreo. Get him! I'm a little bit disappointed in the Twix. Shake. It doesn't taste anything like Twix. <laughs> but... The white chocolate without coffee is good. Anyways, guys, we're gonna drink that and I'll catch you a little later. Cheers. Can't, they can't even see you. Yes, I'm right here. I'm right there. We're for a glass of wine before we go to our favorite Italian spot. Yeah. Oh, am I supposed to drink? <laughs> Nothing in my hand though. No, 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 no. All right, the appetizers came. What you see is burrata with prosciutto and pears and nuts, and then some tartufo salami, tartufo cheese, breadsticks, breads, olives, everything amazing. I'm sorry the setup is not the best, I know. I tried to put the camera somewhere and I ended up putting it in my water glass, 
But yeah, so we have the burrata. Ooh, look how juicy that is. And the prosciutto with the Paris, which was super delicious, by the way. Then I also got some tartufo cheese and some tartufo salami, which was really delicious as well. I tried to optimize the camera setting there, but it was not gonna happen. But yeah, this is one of my favorite appetizers. The charcuterie board with cheeses and meats. Just, yeah, I don't know. Probably my European descent, I don't know, but I just love it so much. And I believe, or I think that it's especially good at Louis Bossies. But yeah, so we were having that. It also came with dried fruits, like raisins and pickled vegetables, which I had none of. I just realized that but yeah so we had this appetizer and as you can see the main course already comes in and this is some pasta rigatoni with bolognese sauce and again I tried to optimize the camera setting I think I'll have it right there from now on and as you can see the pasta is so steaming hot but I couldn't wait and dig in and here's what happened. I actually burned my tongue and then I started drinking a lot of a lot of water and From then on I couldn't really taste the pasta and I got full because of the water which was super unfortunate So at this point right here I decided I just wanted to take the food home and let my tongue cool down for a little bit and enjoy the rest at home Alrighty guys, we are back home. I so apologize for the terrible filming setting at the restaurant, but we went out and we just wanted to enjoy ourselves. So yeah, also here's what happened. So we had this delicious appetizer platter going on that you saw with cheese and um, burrata, prosciutto, and our entree came too fast. And then I tried the pasta, which I have a rest off right here, and I burnt my tongue. So I drank a lot of water, so I got really full. My tongue was burned, so I was like just sitting there. I was like, okay, there's no point in filming this. So we took home what we didn't want to finish there. And now I have the rest of the appetizer platter and the rest of the pasta going on. And I gotta show you what Nate has going on. Nate has the donuts going on and some chips and we have some peanut butter cookie that is in crumbles, but I tried it and it's really good. So yeah, the donuts are for Nate, glass of milk. I have the rest of the pasta and some of the appetizers and we are going to enjoy this. Looking for a movie. <laughs> no, actually while we're watching a movie, I don't know what yet. It's always difficult. Our internet was down too. So now we're finally back home and I'm telling you something. Pasta gets better with time. Pasta is like a dish. I know the noodles is themselves, like the actual pasta. Can get mushy, but I think the flavor gets better every day. Anyways, we're looking for a movie and I'll be back with all this. Right? It's not for you though. It's not for you, little girl. It's for mama. It's for mama. But you, no, 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 no. <laughs> she's, she's so cute though. All right, so we found a movie, so we're gonna watch The Hustlers, and we'll dig in. Alrighty, guys, I'm hitting you with another voiceover and just wanted to dip in and say the pasta was delicious and so were the leftover appetizer bites. Louis Bossi, always a great restaurant to go to. And definitely one of my favorite Italian places. I'm just such a sucker for Italian food, especially pasta, I don't know what it is. I just love pasta. I think I choose pasta over over any main course. Anyways, the movie was great, the food was great, and yeah, just enjoyed uh, watching Hustlers. Can only recommend this very interesting movie. And yeah, that is pretty much all we did and had for the rest of the evening. Alrighty guys, I'm having some of um my granola big shout out to everyone who bought granola from me i really so appreciate it i'm working on a new flavor as you might be able to tell 
Today was an awesome, fun day. We're now trying to get the movie to work because well, the, the internet is down. The Wi-Fi is working on But the Wi-Fi, I heard the Wi-Fi is working again. So I'm gonna have this and then we gonna hit the hay. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Let me get a piece. I love you guys so much. And I see you in the next one. Bye-bye. Let me get a piece.